UCLA averaging fewer points per game than the Trojans. They'll take a shot downfield and an interception to open the game from Drew Lewis. A disastrous start for Daniels and the Trojans. Well, if there's a tendency, check out number 20, Drew Lewis, as he drops back into coverage. And Daniels looked at it just a second too long, but I don't think he ever saw Drew Lewis. Once he started up in the line of scrimmage, I think JT Daniels lost vision of that. And credit Lewis, his first interception of the season, but the senior, you know, he's got that. He said the whole goal is to give him an advantage at what he's most passionate about. He'll take a shot here into double coverage. He'll advised in the second pick of this first quarter thrown by Daniels. Evan Worthington comes down with this one. Struggling the games where JT Daniels has turned over the football. And look, see he's looking at his right the whole entire way. And Evan Worthington, the safety who picked that ball off, he's watching it and tracking it. And you just can't do that. And now motion Montez out, so it is the Wildcat. And it's Chenault breaking it free. There goes. Visca touchdown Colorado. Fifty one yards adding to his Heisman reel and opening the scoring at the Coliseum and then right through an open gap on the left hand side. This is something that Darren Shiverini has really got a hold of It's just getting the ball in his best playmakers hand and putting it in a position to be successful. So they've moved to drive so far tonight. On first down, pressure picked up. End zone shot. It's Vaughn's again. Touchdown Trojans. Beating Chris Miller for 27 yards. So second and 14. Pressure coming off his backside. Steps up and heaves it. Under throws Pittman who came back to get it to give the Trojans their first lead of the night. A 65-yard explosion. Now second and goal. Fake to Carr. On the slant, guess who? Michael Pittman for the USC touchdown. They're down 22 here. Montez, it's crossing Chanel, juggled and picked. Pick six of J.N. Harris for the second year in a row against Colorado. Everyone else is blocking. Watch number three. He's responsible for a J.N. Harris. He doesn't get in front of him. And then Harris, there after a poorly thrown football, is able to get his hands on it. Near the seven minute mark. Evans will try it again. This time he. Is waiting for a signal. Still no signal. That's Fox still <laughs> running. Touchdown. I was just going to say, that's really been the issue with training camp and then so far this year for him. Brown trying to make it a three score game, and he does. So the Trojans in front, 31 14. 505 left to go. Evans motions out. They will play coverage with a four man rush. Montez has it open up for him. He will run and reach to the pylon for the touchdown. Steven Montez with a rushing score. James Stefano is out there as well. So both kickers on the field. This one is recovered by the Buffs. Colorado not dead yet. 319 to go, and they've got it within two scores. Fourth and ten. I'm gonna hang on to a little bit of hope after the onside kick recovery. Montez throwing for Nixon, who can't hang on. That ball is on the money, but Greg Johnson was there in coverage. 